वेलकम एवरी वन वेलकम टू द एनालिटिक्स स्कूल आई एम आशीष दिस सेशन इज बेस्ड ऑन हाउ टू इम्प्लीमेंट के मीन्स क्लस्टरिंग एलगोरथम इन आर वी हैव ऑलरेडी डिस्कस अबाउट द वेरियस क्लस्टरिंग टेक्निक वट इज क्लस्टरिंग मीन्स एंड वट इज द के मीन्स क्लस्टरिंग मीन्स एंड नाउ इट इज अ प्रैक्टिकल एप्लीकेशन हाउ टू इम्प्लीमेंट के मीन क्लस्टरिंग इन आर सो आई हैव डिवाइडेड द स्टेप्स इन टू फाइव थिंग्स फर्स्ट स्टेप इज दैट वील इम्पोर्ट आयरिस डेटा सेट इन आर this is the data set on which we'll perform our analysis second we'll preview the data set we'll have a feel of the data set third is we'll perform the k means analysis fourth we'll see the result and fifth we'll check the accuracy of the k means so let's start by importing the iris data set in r data set iris could no data iris now we'll see the data set head of iris we can see that there are four column sepal length sepal width petal length petal width and fifth species and these are the attributes let's see there are how many rows n row iris there are 150 row that means there are 150 kind of species in this data set and the column as we can already see but still we have five column four are the sepal and sepal width petal and petal width one is species so there are three kinds of species here let's uh, change this data set copy this data set into another variable but we'll not have this fifth variable species here and we'll have only the first four categorical variable so let's copy it into fifth variable let's rename res result or yes iris now we'll species null now let's look at res we can see the fourth variable fifth variable species is not there and only there are four variables sepal and sepal width petal and the petal width now let's perform k means analysis final result let i am defining another variable fres k means res you will have to specify that how many cluster you want so i am specifying that i want three cluster so let's see fres i am getting this output k means clustering with three cluster of size 62 38 and 50 there are three clusters and first cluster has 62 items in it second cluster has 38 items in it third cluster has 50 items in it if we'll add up this 62 plus 38 is 100 100 plus 50 is 50 150 so there are 150 items this second thing is cluster means cluster 1 has sepal length mean of 5.9 cluster 2 has sepal length of 5 6.85 cluster 3 has sepal length mean of 5.00 so as we can see that these means are pretty much separated so there are three different clusters formed out of it and this is the clustering vector what does clustering vector means it means that item 1 has been classified into cluster number 3 item 2 has been classified into cluster number 3 item 3 has been classified into cluster number 3 and so on so this is the clustering vector fourth is within cluster sum of square by cluster the plus for the cluster 1 the value is 39.8 for cluster 2 value is 23.87 for cluster 3 value is 51 15.15 also there are some available components which are cluster centers t toss uh, sorry uh, t total sum of square within sum of square total dot within sum of square between sum of squares size iter i fold let's look at it that what are they so 
if I type f press dollar I can see I will choose size from here so we can see that this size is there the size of the cluster 62 items 38 items and 50 items you will see it will type cluster here we can see the clustering vector here so now let's compare the cluster with our original actual value so I'll compare fres dollar cluster is it will give me the clustering vector and initial iris dollar the fifth column which we eliminated that is species the species column I'll plot it into a table to see the accuracy so I can see this Cetosa in the iris variable has 50 species into it and that is classified has that has been correctly classified into our cluster number 3 and Versi color has 50 species, species into it into the original data set that is 48 plus 2 48 has been correctly classified to into cluster number 1 and 2 has been wrongly classified so we can say that Versi color correspond to this one and Setosa correspond to cluster number 3 this Virginica in this Virginica 36 has been classified into cluster number 2 while 14 has been wrongly classified into cluster number 1 so there are inaccuracies is a little bit high in here so we can map these clusters that Setosa correspond to cluster number 3 Versi color correspond to the cluster number 1 and Virginica correspond to the cluster number 2 so this is how we perform clustering analysis in R thank you and subscribe my channel for more updates on analytics thank you